to say thank you to people who are working out there in that warehouse, people who are working in the kitchen. I want to say thank you to new leaders like you who in the middle of COVID said yes anyway. Now, what I get to say that I do, and what you all, those of you in the room, those of you who will see this later, what you get to say that you do, is you help to put food on people's tables. That is powerful. That's easy to say. Easy to explain. But it's very, very hard to do. So it's my great honor and privilege to have the opportunity to visit this food bank and to thank you all for what you're doing. In this short window of time, I've already learned so much. One of the things I'm not surprised to have now discovered for myself is the passion that all of you have for the work that you do. I can tell. Passion's something that's powerful. I can feel it. I felt it when I walked through the door, and I felt it every moment that I've had an encounter with any one of you since I've been here. I'm so pleased, but I'm not surprised. Because around the country, when I meet people who do what you do, I can tell that they do it because they care about people facing hunger. I can tell that what wakes them up in the morning is understanding how important their work is. So while it was something that needed confirmation, it certainly wasn't a surprise. But I did learn some other stuff too. I learned about some of the first here going out there and seeing that food truck, and now that I've eaten some of the food, can you tell me when you're gonna be out in that food truck again? I think I might wanna drive all the way to Tulsa just to go to the food truck. I mean, it's extraordinary. Some of the firsts that have happened here are great. Going out there and talking to that young woman, and she's so proud, I told her she's a modern day farmer, right? And looking at the various innovations that are happening out there, banks like this one with these wonderful innovations that I can then bring back to wherever it is that I go next and I can share some of those best practices and that's part of the beauty of being a part of this network. So you have so much to be proud of and I hope that you are proud of what you do here. So I wanted to thank you. I wanted to learn and I want to use those learnings and apply them in a way that has meaning, not just inside of the community that you have the primary fiduciary responsibility to serve, but that can touch across the U.S. so that we can make manifest that vision of a hunger-free America. African proverb that says, one cannot eat an okra with one finger. And it's an acknowledgement through that proverb of the fact that the most powerful things that we ever accomplish in this life, we do in concert and in partnership with other people. We a symbol of the commitment that Feeding America National Office has to be great partners with people like you, and you, and you, and you, and you, and all of you, and you too, sir, and all of you on the film who I don't get an opportunity to actually see in person this time. It's, it's designed to be a symbol of our commitment to working in partnership with you so that we can in fact achieve our goal of a hunger for America. Thank you so much. Thank you.